So, uh, now we have the upgraded belt and helmet and something else I, I don't remember. Oh, we also need little pads. Oh, we, okay. I want to make the supreme time charm now. So there's a few things we need to do. There we go. All right, chat. It is time for me to do something. There we go. The Supreme Time Charm. Bring this back to Elise. She'll know what to do with it. And we can also buy the upgrade. Oh, I can get two upgrades if I wanted. Let's get two upgrades. Screw it. Whoa, you managed to get the Supreme Time Charm. We need to secure it to safety. Use the warp to the gallery. I will meet you there. Whoa, it's the museum. This is the Rift Gallery. The wizards managed to take control of this section of the dimension for use in my necklace project. Secure time charms here every time you find one. Place the supreme time charm in the right slot of the gallery. Oh, whoa, there's so many. Supreme, we're supreme. The right side? He's got a skyblock level from that. Also, according to chat, there's a cat soul in here. Oh, <laughs> it's a doorbell. <laughs> Marvelous. I frankly did not expect that much from you. Here is the necklace. Oh, so this is the best necklace in the game, according to somebody, right? First, it becomes way stronger the more time charms you correct collect second the real powers outside in the real universe come and see me in the wizard tower for the skyblock hub in the skyblock hub although i might not be too kind out there simply tell my outside self the keyword caramel and i should understand so again this is according to a lot of people the best necklace in the game because you can recom it apparently right and it'd be divine. Okay. I don't know what to do now. We got necklace. Do we kill another one of those leech things? Because there's more recipes. Do you only get one of them? Or can you get multiple rift necklaces? Also, someone mentioned something about parkour in this area. And I can see that. I don't know what this is for. What is this? Oh, okay. Oh, we can go into the West Village now. Hello, Shadow. I don't know what that does. Oh my god, it literally is the village. Where's the cat soul up here? Found a piece of Montezuma's soul again. We're getting rift time like crazy now. You might think you might think it's expensive, and it is. Why? <laughs> what are these? What is this? Hello, Shadow. Uh, uh! Whoa! That's crazy! I like these bosses, man. These are cool. Oh, he's got the... It dropped the Shadow Crux. Oh, that's how you upgrade the Talisman. Can I damage it while it's doing that or no? Also, what's Volt? Can I attack Volt? I have a feeling it's going to electrocute me. Oh. Um, I don't know what that... Ow. I don't know what's happening. I got a Volt Crux. And that's how you get the T3 of the Talisman, apparently. So was that the safe block? The one that I was pointed at? Also, there better be a warp to get all the way over there. Oh, there's a grandma here. Back in my day, booster cookies were 800k. Is that all you have to say? Hello, Cosmo. Us dolphins have to go through heavy training before being sent to space. Want to give it a shot? Sure. Here you go. What? Dive in the water, pretend you're a dolphin. Whoa! What is that? What is that? Wait, get anything from doing this? Yes, I do, actually. I get a soul. Hey! That actually had the uh, proper... Diver armor's ability, pretty much. That actually had a proper purpose there. It's weird how there's just these leeches, just like, whatever these are. The silverfish just swimming around. Disinfector. 
I'm Cat's cousin. How can you have family between dimensions? Unless you got trapped here like the rest of them. I guess that's a thing. So how do these work? So this is the safe block? Oh, I see. So that's what the block was. Interesting. Oh, there's a chicken here. There's chicken and then there's not chicken. What? And does the not chicken go down? Nope, it also goes up. What the hell is over here? <laughs> what is going on? What is this random place? What are these noises? The farmer is sick for a totally unknown reason. None of the animals here have eaten since they started existing. Oh, there's the Wanda farming. Oh, everything has different rules. Caducus are <laughs> upside down plants with, which grow in your humid environments. Collect them from top to bottom. How about Beberus? There was once a powerful necromancer who lived in the catacombs. After a falling out with its administration, she retired to the rift. She started growing wilted burberries. That's the thing we need in the farm plots and operated the dread farm bed and breakfast sadly she passed when her brain melted in an unrelated incident anyway can you harvest the farm patches around the remnants of her decrepit decrepit life work this is like in itself a little mini game you have to hit the one with the particles on it interesting so you need a stack of these to repair the ship right you'll need 40 of each by the way Oh, for that quest, but there's several quests that want my attention here. Oh, oh, there's a collection for these? Oh, hello. The Baba Yaga. Living cave requires intangibility to enter. There's so many things here that we gotta do. We also got the Berberus blowgun recipe. <laughs> we made a blowgun. Whoa, cool. Now we can kill chickens <laughs> oh <laughs> meta metaphoric egg a ticking time bomb to new life acquired using the blowgun so you shoot it a second time while it's in the air and then it just dies and now everyone's saying egg we got the jinxed voodoo doll recipe Another four skyblock XP? What is that? Wait! Oh my god, it's an upgrade of the voodoo doll? Oh! Whoa! A voidling minion? A zombie's heart? Bro! How good is that? Compared to a regular one? I mean, it, I, if I just read. 1800 to... 2600. So it's not quite double. It's like 1.5 times the damage. But it lasts almost three times as long. Interesting. Oh, it lowers the cooldown too? Hold on, really? Five seconds versus three. Dude, that's like... I might actually still use that. That could be good against like many bosses in... um, I don't know about master mode, but definitely in like... I don't know. Is it too... Am I too far into the game for that to matter right now? Museum? True. I mean, maybe for the Crimson Isle mini bosses, but the thing is, like... If I RCM'd, then it would be helpful. Let's talk to Elise, the one in this realm. That's Nicole. Hello, Elise. Go away, I'm extremely busy. I can't focus when blockheads keep interrupting me. You told me to come to you. Look, buddy, I don't know who you think you are, but back off, you're annoying. Carabelle. Whoa, if you know this keyword, it means there's a me out there who figured out how to power the necklace. But since I never stepped into the portal, it means that other me must be a future version of my past self before Barry opened the portal. I do not understand the multi-dimensional journey I must have taken to reach this point. Can I get the necklace? Snaps back to reality, yes. Oh! There we go. Ooh. So there's a... Can I get another one? 
Can you get multiple or just the one? A very powerful piece of equipment originating from the rift. You're so greedy, bro. Hey, I need one to put glistening on and then I need another one to put uh, strengthened on. You know, you know how it is. Put in a museum. Let's speak with Rusty first. Maybe we can get an extra one from him. Oh, you can. Oh, that's beautiful. Oh, that's really good. You can get more than one. Yeah, the Ender necklace is getting replaced soon once I get a recom. It's not going to be useful yet for me until I get a recom for it. Otherwise, it's tied with Ender necklace. What the hell? What am I looking at? What is that? Temporal pillar. Nice. So we get a little extra time. And now we need this. Crux artifact. I'm guessing um, not rift transferable. Pop the balloons with the blowgun. You could do that. I gotta try that. Blowgun. Oh! Oh, look at that. I'm popping the balloons. <laughs> oh, maybe the point is that it drops on the chest. Oh, that's smart. Dude, this update's so freaking cool. Oh, so that's how you harvest that. I see. So chat was trying to tell me I have to hold right click. I see. You, so you start at the top and you hold right click. This is so confusing. Not really. A lot of it's pretty self-explanatory. Like all these mobs, like I just figured out how to kill them pretty much just by playing the game. Which is, it seems to me like really good game design. Like everything's pretty self-explanatory, but there's like a certain level of like learning the game lets you do. Ow. But I don't know. I like it. I think more stuff like uh, this should be in Skyblock where it's very like it's unique and fun, but it's like also something that you don't need to look up a guide for. Like just being able to play the game without looking stuff up seems kind of nice. Crux Artifact. Another 15 seconds of rift time more intelligence crux fortune and it gives milestones for every type of crux mob that you've killed interesting oh my god i think it is or no maybe not it's just different hello cat this is alternate cat <clears throat> i was hired to disinfect this house from the vermin turbo max vacuum cleaner now please deal with the infestation problem you mean all of this vermin bin okay really empty the vacuum you've dumped two vermin and then i got kicked out because i got attacked very cool <laughs> so chat wants me to go into the carrot cave for some reason why is that the cat quest is so busted why oh look at that disinfected gloves so we need spiders and flies. So we're done with silverfish. Spiders and... Oh, hello. Hey, you can't click that yet. I see. Go away, I'm busy. That's not very polite. Did I stutter? We need to find other types of vermin to vacuum up. Mirrorverse. What's in the mirrorverse? Do I want to go in there? I guess we're going in. Mini games. Oh, I am Dr. Emmett, the first human to manage entering the rift. I built the Mirrorverse to better understand portals and their behaviors. I couldn't quite figure out portals. I did manage to let the mirror dimension interact with the real world and vice versa. You can learn. Okay. Interesting. Oh, the lava oofed you. Oh, everything's mirrored. Oh, everything's mirrored. Oh, yeah. This is very strange. This is very strange. It's not truly inverted controls. It's flipped controls, which is different. So it's my brain is struggling to catch up to this. But we're, we're getting it now. Oh, 
Oh, I see. I have to kill mobs in here. I see. <laughs> it's all backwards. We need to make various items in here. So we're gonna make a wob, I guess. So if I were to... <laughs> okay. Oh no, it's flipped, right? <laughs> Chat, we made a wob. Look at that. Uh, I guess a lead? A deal. There we go, we have a deal. Uh, so then backwards fishing rod. A door gn What does this make? <laughs> a rama neat. Tiny hammer. There we go. What is this? Okay. So some of these are real. So the, the first three are real. That one's not. That one's also not. Look up. Oh, it's not trial and error. There's actual thought behind it. Wow, who would have thought? I see. I, you know, I wouldn't have been able to see that because I'm dumb. Imagine no one told me that and I just like went and tried to do all of that my way. That would have taken 10 years. Complete it on hard mode to open the chest. What's hard mode supposed to be? Huh? I'm so confused. Oh! I thought you clicked on the guy. Oh! I, I see. Okay. I see. That makes a lot more sense. I was like, why is it not acting consistently? So I put him in th there. Then him also there. Oh, okay. This is weird. Very strange. Try to think outside of the box. Outside of the box, huh? What was that? The button launches you up? Oh, is that what that does? Oh, okay. Oh, what? Oh, what? <laughs> Uh, oh. Oh, wait, I get it. I understand. I understand how to do it. I see now. Okay, then I swap to this again. Wait, I'm confused. I don't know what happened. Chat, come on. I'm so confused. Both sides need to be on pressure plate. Okay. Oh, I know why. I know how. I know what I got to do here. I need to press the button, switch, jump up, and then land back on the other side. Oh, God. That didn't work. Switch before jumping? So my idea was right, but the execution was wrong. Oh my, okay. I had the, wait. It doesn't stay open? 
That's so toxic. It doesn't even stay open. I literally had the right idea, but didn't execute right. Wait. Yes. Okay. And then I switch again. And then it's only... Th there we go. Oh. There's a reason that I don't play games like Portal 2 on my channel anymore. My brain has clearly rotted. Oh, it's another one of these. Oh, good. Well, at least now I get the concept. Yep. I knew it. Uh -huh. This is going to be so much fun. All right, so now we can click that. Okay, so it's that again. It sounds like a door opening. You hear trap doors open. Oh, wait a minute. Hold on. I see what we're doing. We go like this. It didn't open. What a scam. Wait! It what? I get it now. Okay. Aha! Ha! Puzzle completed. I did it. I did it. It was my unbound thirst of knowledge which brought me to the rift. I built the mirrorverse to better understand the calamity. This is the tubulator. You will need my laser pointer. The tubulator. Oh no. So how does this work? Oh. Oh, what the hell? So this is here. Oh, this is gonna be terrible. Wait. What? I'm so confused. Oh, that's how that works. I see. Okay. Now we're up to date. Yes. I have all the relevant information now. Okay. There we go. There. Nah, now I can see. Now it's just going to be skill issue whether or not I can actually reach. No! This is crazy. Oh. Miniaturized tubulator. Don't hate the player, hate the game. I see. Okay, now what's this? Is this the dance? Congratulations, you reached the end of the mirrorverse. I hope you gained valuable insights here. Accept these motes as a reward for your efforts. 